Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome. My name is Vanessa and in today's video, I'm going to show you my CVS second haul for the week of June 13 to June 19 and these are all digital and printable coupons. So let's start with my first transaction. I grabbed the L'Oreal Alvive deal. They are on sale for two for eight dollars and when you spend eight dollars you get four dollars extra bucks and i grabbed three because i have a five dollar off three digital coupon for this so total of the three is twelve dollars and total after my coupon was seven dollars but i earned four dollars extra bucks making these three dollars or one dollar each and I combined the Garnier Fructis guys because I used a hair care CRT which is $3 off $18 hair care CRT and the Garnier Fructis is on sale for $2 for $7 and that includes the treatment so I grabbed two of the Garnier Smoothing Treat Avocado Extract and I have a $2 of one digital coupon for this and i also have a two dollar of one printable coupon and all of us received the instant coupon which is two dollar of two making my cost for this one dollar only or 50 cents each but that is not the final price because i have the hair care crt so let's combine this shampoo and conditioner and the treatments total is 19 dollars and I have a total of $14 coupons, making my total after coupons $5. But I earned $4 extra buck, bringing my final cost for 5 items only $1 or $0.20 cents each. And this tracks towards beauty. So here's my receipt. And all of my coupons came off. I just rolled $5 extra bucks, making my subtotal zero. Plus tax, I paid $1.20 using my Fetch gift card. And I already earned $4 extra bucks for these guys, but I use it in my next transaction. And as you can see, I only needed to earn $5.54 to get another $3 extra box so I'll be expecting a $3 extra box from Beauty Club after 48 hours. Then for my next transaction, I did my spend $45 deal and get $15 extra box. So I grabbed the CVS Health Extra Strength Acetaminophen Pain Reliever. This is $12.79 and I have a $3 off CVS Health Pain CRT. And I also have a $4 off $12 CVS Pain Relief CRT. And then I grabbed the Unisom Simple Slumbers. A big shout out to my friend Couponing and Save with Jackie. She mentioned about this and told me to print a coupon from the website, which I did. So I printed one. And this is $12.99. And I also have a $2 off $10 any pain relief CRT. Then I added the Duracell Optimum. This is $7.99. And this is also included in the deal. And I have a $5 off app only CRT. And the last one was the Tide Laundry Detergent. They are on sale for $11.94. And I have a $3 of one digital coupon. So total for this is $45.71. So I already reached the spend amount and I have a total of $21 coupons. Making my total out of pocket for this $24.71. But I earned $15 extra bucks. Plus I submitted my receipt to Ibotta and I got back $8 for buying the Unisome. Making my final cost for this $1.71 for 4 items or $0.42 cents each. And here's my receipt. Here's my Tide and my Duracell Optimum, guys. 
my cashier adjusted it to $2.99 because at first, my $5 off app only CRT won't come off. So what she did, she just adjusted the price and I told her that if she adjusted the price, I will no longer meet the spend amount. But she said it's okay. She will just force print me a $5 extra box. All of my coupons came off except the $5 of Duracell battery. And then I rolled a total of $21 extra box. That's the only extra box I had. Then here's the $4 from buying the L'Oreal All Vibe. So I also have some Care Pass 14 cents here. Bringing my subtotal to $3.57. Plus tax, I paid $5.94 still using my gift card. And here's the $10 extra box. Only $10 extra box was printed guys because like I said, the cashier adjusted the price for the Duracell Optimum. But she printed me this one, $5. So I still got a total of $15 extra box. And for my third transaction, I used my other account. So I grabbed again the CoverGirl. They are buy two, get $5 extra box or buy three get seven dollars extra box and i only grabbed two so i grabbed the cover girl press powder here price at eight dollars and 59 cents and i have a three dollar face product digital coupon and then i added the cover girl perfect blend eyeliner they are seven dollars and 29 cents and i also have a three dollar digital coupon for this and this account also has the $2 of CoverGirl Cosmetics CRT, which is the mystery coupon. And then I use a $3 of $15 Cosmetics CRT, bringing my total to $4.88. But I got back $5 extra bucks, making this free plus a $0.12 cent money maker. So here's the receipt. Everything went fine, guys. Then I rolled... $5 extra box that was adjusted to $4.88 bringing my subtotal to zero plus tax I paid 97 cents using my fetch gift card and here's the $5 extra box for buying the cover girl and for my fourth transaction guys this is the weird part my receipt is weird guys I will show you later so please stay tuned so I grabbed the spend $25 any check skin to mate resource and get $10 extra box. And I grabbed the skin to mate disposable price at $9.79. And I have a $3 of one skin to mate or check digital coupon. And I also have a $2 of skin to mate CRT. And then I added this check man hydro refill price at $18.79 and I have a $3 of one Sheck Refill Digital Coupon and I also have a $4 of Sheck Hydro Men Refill CRT. That brings my total after coupons $16.58 but I got back $10 extra bucks making my cost $6.58 or $3.29 but I combined this with the crest deal guys supposedly because i use my six dollars of thirty dollar any shave and oral crt so i grab four of the crest they are on sale for two for six dollars so total is twelve dollars and i have those five dollar of three crest digital coupon and the one dollar of one crest digital coupon bringing my total amount forty dollars and fifty eight cents so what happened guys here's the receipt i will show you so the skin to mate is possible and the shake hydro refill is fine but my crest was ringing five dollar and 79 cents and the tree were five dollar and 49 cents i didn't notice this while we were still doing the transaction guys because my subtotal was already zero. I only gave my cashier $10 and $6 extra bucks. That's the only extra bucks that I was going to roll. 
to be able to get the lower subtotal i was expecting a 58 cent subtotal and when my cashier told me that the subtotal was zero i was not even thinking that there was a problem so the cashier went on and printed the receipt and then when i received the receipt my ten dollar extra box for buying the skin to meet and check printed but my six dollars for crest did not so i checked the receipt then i noticed that the crest was not ringing on sale like two for six dollars and i grabbed this four toothpaste guys with a tag two for six dollars so yeah and then some more there was another ten dollar and 84 cents which i cannot really think where did this came from guys i didn't send to card any extra box except three dollar and and i didn't use someone the three dollar is still there i didn't have any other ten dollar and i'm really confused until now where i got this i didn't know also what happened because normally my cashier will just force print me an extra box if it is not printing but we just went to the returning of the items so i just returned the four crest and i got this refund guys 71 cents for my tax and 13 dollars and 75 cents total for my coupons so let me know guys if you have experienced this also and if you can help me solve the mystery where I got this $10 and the 84 cents. I really don't know guys. Please leave me a comment if you have any thoughts about this. Thank you so much. And for my last transaction, I did the spend $45, get $15 extra box. But I thought the syndrome is included, guys. I just saw it in the ads. But only the Centrum benefit that is included. But then I still continued to take the Centrum silver because I plan to give this to my father-in-law. So I grabbed the Centrum silver. This is $11.99. And I have a $3 of one digital coupon and a three dollar of Sintrom CRT and then I grabbed the L'Oreal H Perfect they are $19.79 and I have two of the five dollar of L'Oreal H Perfect CRT and I grabbed another Tide this is on sale for $11.94 and I have the three dollar of one digital coupon and I also use my $8 of $40 next purchase CRT. And I added this post grade grain cereal. I forgot that I only need to spend $30 because the Centrum was already not included. But still, I took what is in my list, which is the post grade grains. They are on sale for $1.88 and they are also part of the spend. 30 or spend 45 deal and anyway i grab one so total for all of this is 45 dollars and 60 cents and i have a total of 27 dollars coupon making my total cost for this 18 dollar and 60 cents but i got back 10 dollar for spending 30 dollar deal making my final cost for this eight dollars and sixty cents or two dollar and fifteen cents each here's my receipt and all of the coupons came off and i rolled my ten dollar extra box for buying this kintimate and check here and then my previous ones four dollar and four dollar bringing my subtotal to sixty cents plus stock i paid two dollar and twenty eight cents still using my gift card and here's the $10 extra box for spending $30. So let's go over with the final numbers and determine how much is the cost per item if we combine everything. 
The total amount of all of these products is $149.77. Total coupons used was $83.49. Bringing my total out of pocket for this $66.28. But I earned a total of $58.46 from CVS. $4.00. For buying the L'Oreal O5, $10 for my spend 30 deal, $5 extra box that my cashier force printed for me, $5 extra box for the cover girl, $10 from Shake or Skin Timate, and then $10 from spend 30 deal from the other account, and then the refund. I got a total of $14.46. And I also got $8 from Ibotta for buying the Unisome, making my final cost free plus an 18 cents money maker. I didn't even count the $3 extra box that I will get after 48 hours, guys. So that's it. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give this a thumbs up. And if you want to learn more about couponing and follow my journey of savings, please consider to subscribe and also hit that notification bell so you will not miss any of my video. And please don't forget to comment down below guys what are your thoughts about the receipts that is weird. If you have any idea, please let me know. Thank you so much and I will see you on my next video. Bye-bye!